All right, we're ready for our printmaking. We have our brayer, we have our printing ink. We're going to get our ink ready. Right now it is in a glob, but we want to prepare our ink. We're gonna do our two S's. We are gonna hear that sticky noise and we want our ink to be shiny. This is starting to get smaller lines in it. Looking for those little bubbles. If we do it too much, it will be matte and dull and we want it shiny. So my ink's ready. I'm gonna pull my jelly plate over very slowly. I'm gonna roll my ink on back and forth, get the edges. You need to pick up some more ink, pick up more ink. You wanna go slow. When you're done, you're gonna take your leaf. Now your leaf has two sides. This is the front, this is the back. This is the raised side. You can feel the vein of the leaf. We are going to place vein down. So you set up your leaves any way you want. I think I'm gonna have this one go off the edge. Got my maple one. I think I'll put that up there and I think I'll try to include that stem. Now that I'm set with that, I'm gonna get my paper. I'm gonna line it up on top. Once I press it down, I cannot pick it up. And I'm gonna give a gentle massage, getting all the edges. Now this print we're gonna make, it's gonna give us negative shapes. So we'll be seeing the shape of the leaf, but none of the details inside. When you think you've gotten all your areas, very carefully pull your paper off, and there are our negative shapes. We just see the outline of the leaves. We can take our leaves and dispose of them. And if you look on your jelly plate, you can see the veins of the inside. So we're gonna reprint very carefully with two hands. You're gonna flip it back over so it lines back up as best you can. Lay it down and another massage. We're double printing this plate. We're gonna pick up what was ever left on our printing plate or our jelly plate onto our paper. Now we see all the veins of our leaf on our print. Now we're gonna use oil pastels to create our pumpkin. And we wanna get some highlights and some shadows to make it more three-dimensional. I'm gonna start with a light color. I think I'll do yellow. And I'm gonna do a C and a backward C. Now I don't want my pumpkin too big because I still wanna see my leaves. Oil pastels are like really nice crayons and they're meant to be blended together. So I'm gonna lay my base layer down, nice and solid. Then I'm gonna pick up a darker orange and all my lines are going to be going into like a curved pattern the way of the pumpkin to help show 3D. Find a darker one. When you start getting darker, you can start getting those lines in. The ribs of the pumpkin, they start at the center and they curve out. The other side goes opposite like that. Now I'm gonna start just lightly moving my oil pastel back and forth. I have a light coming from this side here, so it's gonna be a little bit lighter on the top and we'll have it darker on the bottom with a shadow on this side. Leaving some of that yellow in there. Okay, 
I want to define this pumpkin a little bit more so I can probably pick up some brown. That one's not dark enough. I'll find a darker one. Kind of go over where those curved lines are. So we're creating value, different colors. I'll put some dark at the bottom, working my way lighter so it blends. And now I can go ahead and add my stem. I'll start with the lighter green curved line, make it look three dimensional. That looks flat, so we can go ahead and add some shading in there. Maybe get another green, brown, a little bit of gray, put some texture in that. When you're all done, we can cut it out very carefully around the edges. Don't cut that stem off. We're gonna add just a little bit of glue to the back. This glue is gonna kind of activate our ink, so you don't want too much, just a few dots on the edge. Get your print back. Decide where you want it. Do you want it down in the middle? I think I like it down here, and then we can see more of my leaves. I like this one up there because it's a little bit bigger. So we created a print with our jelly plates. We got a negative shape. Then we did a double print and got the uh, texture and leaf, um, veins of the leaf. We created a pumpkin. We made it look three-dimensional using uh, highlights and sh shadowing with our oil pastels.